there are so many sort of areas of industry where you would say, oh, it costs $100 million to actually build a new nuclear plant research, whatever. And if you look at the last batch of uh, Y Combinator, which is the most successful sort of incubator uh, in the US, they actually had a couple of teams actually doing research in, in nuclear. And they got, you know, sort of a traditional startup funding. So there are so many sort of new areas where you can innovate because the barrier to innovation has dropped, the, the dollar uh, buyer has, yeah. has dropped is pretty fascinating. Uh, one of my investments, uh, and I answer your question, I'm not avoiding it, um, is sort of in, in brain hacking, where it's a headband that sends micro current in your brain to actually increase the, effic the efficacy of your memory, so that a 47 year old like me can recover the memory as if uh, you know that I had when I was a 25 year old. That's pretty crazy, and you know it works. So to your question. Yes, we're bringing capital. It's, it's sort of the necessary devil, but there is so much money available now at every stage of the funding sort of uh, curve in Silicon Valley that the differentiation is how good you are at delivering value added to your entrepreneurs, whether it's through your connections, through you know, the network you've built with your companies and, and, and your portfolio, and how good you are at recruiting. And, and so it's really your track record at supporting the entrepreneurs that gets you in the deal. The fact that you want to invest, there's for every dollar that gets invested, there's five, 10, 20 other that is waiting on the sidelines.